friends have no time to lose as they race to try to stop the revival of Nemesis, God of Destruction. They immediately meet their enemies, and the Bay battles begin. Yuki and Anubius take on Aguma and his Kronos, while newcomers Herschel and Kaiser launch their bays to take on King and Masamune. As these fights rage on, Panemus and a reluctant Jenga launch at each other as well. Suddenly, Kiyoya, Yu, and Tithi literally burst through a wall to join the fray. Kiyoya jumps in the battle by launching his Leon against Dynamis and Jupiter, taking Jenga out of the match for the moment. Tithi, too, is eager to jump in, and he draws his Kitzel Gordel and sends it flying against Aguma's Kronos. No one is backing down an inch in any of the battles, and the stakes could not be higher! Nemesis' is revival? The Black Sun? I don't care about those things. I only care about settling things with Jenga, get it? That said, if I can't battle Jenga until something is done about all this other stuff, then I'll do something. I'll crush anyone who gets in the way. Now then, give me your best shot, pal. Kiyoya! Well, let's get started, too! Wait, are you really sure you want to jump right into a battle with a guy like Aguma? Move. She's right. See? That move. It's fine. This will be fun. Urgh. For Nemesis to fully revive, it needs as much of the power of the light that fell from the sky as we can possibly get for it. Come on! This is the Venus Bay? Quetzalcoatl? Is it? Show me its power! Power of your spring bay, Leon, shall be offered up to the god of destruction as well. Don't think so. You're not in charge here. That's not what Leon's power is for. Leon! I won't lose. You're going down. Huh? Kronos was just pushed back. Yo-Yo and Tiffy look like they're having fun out there. Ah! I want in on the fun! Go there, Eris! Charge, Striker! Go! Libra! Ah, why you? Nice! Hey, King, mm -hmm. time for us to make our move. Yeah! Can't let these guys just show up and steal our thunder. Very Eris! Striker! Uh, Ice Titan! Ah, don't tell me those guys are fighting now, too! What should we do, Jenga? I... I just don't know! Ah, ah. Hit him hard, Leon! <laughs> Go, Jupiter! He stopped it cold! Huh, that's what I'm talking about! Joya has Leon set in defense mode. Now that's really interesting. Uh-huh. What are you doing here, Jenga? Oh! There's absolutely nothing more for you to do here. Don't just stand there. Hurry up and get out of here! Times. Huh? Two more to go. Hurry, Jenga. There is no time. Ah! Dynamis! Ah! Hmm. Ah! Dynamis! I see. A righteous heart. Gaia's wish. The hearts of the warriors of the four seasons must be. Made one! Two more to go. I see. I think I finally understand. Understand what? Jenga? Okay, time to go. Wait, Jenga! Mr. Jenga! 
They are running! Let them go! Huh? There are many more traps waiting up ahead for them to find. We need to stay here and fight. The intruders must be punished! Keep your eyes on the battle! Go now, Barrieris! Charge hard, Libra! Yeah. I'm sorry, everyone, but we have to go right now! Okay, leave it to me! Leave it to you? You think so? Hit him! Exploding fast! Whoa! I can't move forward now! How's that? Oh. Your base fusion wheel makes it easy for my Kronos to hold it back with its air current! Now I'm gonna send you flying! Hear me? Ha! Yeah! That's awesome! You really are strong for sure! But still! No way! Your attack is too straightforward for me! Why, you? What now? Ah! You should have more fun with the bay battle, don't you think? Huh? You... you... you are... A lot more fun than you are! Quit <laughs> fooling around! Huh? A fight has meaning only if you win it! Victory is everything! Why? Mr. Jenga! What is it, Jenga? Just what is it that you understand? That time on Mist Mountain! Dynamis said it! Those who possess pieces of the Star Fragment have roles to play. The role of the legendary bladers who inherited the Solar System Bays is to lend their strength in order to prevent the God of Destruction from going on a rampage in the event that Nemesis is revived. And they must choose their own future in the age in which they find themselves living today. That is the role of the legendary bladers who hold the newly created bays of the Four Seasons. Whether or not the God of Destruction is allowed to be revived is up to the newly chosen by the Star Fragment, the legendary bladers of the Four Seasons. If Nemesis's revival is to be prevented, the hearts of the legendary bladers of the Four Seasons who receive the power of Gaia must become one. <gasps> the hearts of the legendary bladers must become one. That makes sense. We've been so totally worried since Nemesis began its revival that we forgot something important. If their hearts are righteous, and if they desire to save the world from the God of Destruction, then I will follow the will of the heavens and fight with them. And if they desire the revival of the God of Destruction, then that is also the will of the heavens. Heh, well then there's no problem! Of course we don't want the revival of the God of Destruction! We'll take down anyone who thinks it's cool to destroy the world! That's just a no-brainer! Right, Kiyoya? No matter the reason, Kiyoya's and my goal has become one and the same! But there are still some legendary bladers of the Four Seasons who actually wish for the God of Destruction's revival! Oh, yeah! But first, we must open their eyes so they can see. The remaining legendary bladers of the Four Seasons are as follows. Holder of the Bay, Phantom Orion BD, Chris, mm. and... The other one is... Huh? What? Ah! Huh? Who's that? It's... it's him! Ryuga! Move now! Calling loudly to me! Oh! Wait, Ryuga! Ryuga! <sighs> Ryuga! K Kenta? <gasps> Mr. Jenga! You've come! Chris! I've been waiting. So, shall we begin? Wait a minute, Chris! You've just become a legendary blader, right? You don't know the details. Please listen to me. Listen to what I have to say. The evildoers. Nemesis's revival is all they want. 
they're using you. Don't you understand that? If they manage to completely revive Nemesis, do you know what will happen to the world that we know? I'm a blader for hire. <gasps> the contract with my employer is all that matters. I'm not concerned with their goals. None of my business. Chris? I have a job to do, that's all. The job is you, Jenga. We are to battle here and now. That is all. Chris, take aim. Uh, uh. Fine then. We're both bladers, right? And as such, we should be able to express our thoughts and feelings to each other through battle. Let me express to you that I don't care. Let's do this. If we clash with all of our might, maybe it'll get through your thick skull that you have a true base spirit inside you. Huh? Give it a rest with the rambling and battle. Let it rip! Go now, Phantom Orion! Pegasus! Defense performance tip with excellent defensive power. It can withstand an attack like that with no problem. There's no need to rush. It is still Pegasus's turn anyway. What? Pegasus's turn? You just wait patiently until all of Pegasus's power has been drawn out of it, okay? After he's finished, you're up. All of the power of the star fragment that your bay possesses will be offered up to Nemesis as well. Just so you know what your fate is, my little friend. Nemesis? Did he say drawing out all of its power? Don't tell me. It can't be. Yeah! More, more, keep going now! <gasps> 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 
there's no mistake. When two bays possessing the same power of the Star Fragment battle, that power is carried from the stadium to someplace else. Pegasus! Upper mode! Ah! Ugh, that didn't work! It looks like this is as far as it goes. My bearing drive performance tip can spin forever. On the other hand, your Pegasus is done. Your attacks are draining all your power. Your stamina is almost gone. At this rate, even if I do nothing, my victory is assured. I don't get it. We keep fighting. I keep attacking. I still don't feel any passion from you at all out there. Why? Why, Chris? You're just like your Bay Orion. No matter how intense the fight is, you just spin, indifferent, as if nothing has happened at all out there. Why are you like that? Because that is how I live my life. No matter what orders I get, I will carry them out, that's all. Coolly and completely. Not that. I'm not asking you that at all. What? Listen, I'm asking if you enjoy having battles like that, ones that mean nothing to you. If you don't battle for your own sake, then what in the world does Beyblade mean to you? My employer's orders are absolute, hear me? Executing those orders is my only battle, my focus. Even if those orders will destroy our base and our future on this very planet itself, is that it? <gasps> Get it! You have so much power in you! You are such an awesome blader! So how did you become the way you are exactly? It is all because of that very power! Huh? It's because of this strength! I used to fight like you do a very long time ago. I trained long and hard with my friends, aiming to make it to the world tournament as well, like everyone else. But then... That decides it! Chris wins with his overwhelming strength! Yes! Okay, I did it! Huh? Chris, sorry. We lost. Sorry. Don't worry about it. We just have to try harder next time, right? <sighs> Even if I won myself, you can't go to the world tournament if your team doesn't win. Chris wins once again! Ah! What did you say? We can't do this anymore. We quit. What? We're sorry. Uh? Hey, wait a second! Not only was my dream of going to the world tournament crushed, my friends left me as well. It was because I became too strong, see? Once I realized it, there was not a single person willing to battle me anymore. Because I was too strong, I was kicked out of the normal Beyblade world. Because you were too strong? That's like the story King told us as well. I said if that was the case, then that was gonna be just fine with me. I learned to live all alone, and now here I am. There are people in the world who need my strength and they will pay for it. So I need to be sure to win no matter where, when, or what the circumstances are. Do you hear me? You have absolutely no right to be judging me. So you just turned your back on it all. On the fun of Beyblade, the excitement and joy, laughing and competing with your friends and rivals for that life? Those friends were the ones who chose to leave me. I fight only for those who need my strength. So stop bugging me with this stuff. So Chris, I get it. So that's what happened. Now I finally understand why the Star Fragment chose you. It all makes sense now. Huh? To live in this age and choose our own future. That's the role that we, the four legendary bladers, must play. But simply, defeating the evildoers and saving the world from destruction is not all we must do. Chris, we have to create a bright future that gives hope to those like you who have had sad experiences with Beyblade so they can live. <gasps> King realized that when he met Masamune and made a lifelong friend. 
Listen to me. In order to make the hearts of the legendary bladers of the Four Seasons one, I have to make you understand that same thing the King came to know is true for you. I am a blader for hire. I use my bay to do my job. My bay serves that purpose. This is all nonsense. That's a lie. Ah. The truth is that deep down in your heart, even you wanted to have a spirited bay battle. When you battled Masamune, you got fired up. Just for a moment it happened. That's why the Star Fragment reacted. <sighs> it left the shining future of Beyblade up to you, pal. You're a legendary blader and you can't change that. <sighs> Chris, don't listen to his lies, okay? I'm doing this. This time I'll be the one to get your Bay Spirit all fired up with my Bay Pegasus and my special move. Chris, I know. I will carry out the duty that was assigned to me, okay? Whoa! 